This is my reaction to Assassination Classroom Season 1, Episode 15, End of Term Time. So I'm assuming we're going to finish the finals, or start the finals at least. In the last episode, the asshole guy kind of worked with um, Kura-sensei's brother and Kura-sensei's brother's master. Um, but then that backfires, so he's like, no, I'm not going to do that anymore because he realized that he shouldn't have trusted them. Also, it's raining, so if you hear rain, apologies, but it's happening. Also, if you like full reactions to Assassination Classroom and other show that react, you can join my patrons, which will be linked down below. So, yeah, let's go. Oh my god, this thing again. Dear god. No. I don't think so. Kurosawa has got some studying in them. Why is he wearing the Naruto headband? I've never seen Naruto, but I recognize the headband. I think that was it. One less appendage, and already the integrity of my doppelgangers is compromised. Note that several of them have now become childhood versions of yours truly. Oh. Okay, seems logical. Lose another, and presto! Yay! Even more child clones thrown into the mix, along with fretful parent clones struggling to make it. <coughs> now it's getting a little sad. That's getting weird. Lose another, and the father clone has walked out, leaving the poor beleaguered mother clone to fend for her latchkey brood, however she can. This is so weird. Dual subjects are vouchsafed the right to obliterate exactly one identical apiece. <laughs> This is how we do finals here. Damn. So Karma's definitely getting it. Karma's getting a jabbing. Now I guess I'll probably too. That's all I got. Maybe the AI girl, I forget her name though, but maybe her. Frankly, your suggestion appalls me. I'm an educator. I've no vested interest in seeing E class fail. Well, I can see that. It's this stuff shirt who needs convincing. Let me be perfectly clear. The chief aim of this institution is to foster student autonomy. Our students determine their own level of achievement. My role is in... I also think he might be the... Kurosensei's brother's master. That's just a theory I have. It's hard to trust a man who throws $10 words in your... It's being led by a bunch of geniuses. The school's finest. They're called the Big Five. The Big Five. Coming in at second place... Is that anything similar to the Big Three in My Hero Academia? ...social networking conglomerate CEO in training, media club president and social engineer, Tepe Araki. Right. In third place... I'm not gonna remember any of these people. ...in fifth place, a true sorcerer of science... Oh, I remember this guy. ...the sun around which the entire student body orbits. Alas, storm clouds are moving in... Who's that? Casting their pall of our brilliance from below. Hoisting his flag on the top spot of the national mock exams with perfect scores in every subject. The man with a genetic disposition to lead. Student Council President, Gargashu Asano! The principal's only son. Mr. President, about question three. <laughs> ah, that is a puzzler. Tr I reserved as a spot. Actually been holding on to this for a while. Normally, we're dead last on the waiting list, so this little miracle is like a platinum ticket. <laughs> Me too. Look at how fired up they are. It was so Pop Ox. That's line. funny. One more thing. A simple question. Not asking as a student, but as your son. Oh. Oh, dear. I do hope you don't expect special treatment. No, no. Wouldn't dream of it. It's just simple curiosity. What is it about E-Class? It's almost like you have something to hide. Ooh. You haven't raised an idiot, father. Any fool can see the idlers have more claim to your attention these days than in your I like previous. him. Hard as it is to give credit to, why on earth would I do that? But you could hardly blame me if I were. I am your protege. <laughs> nice touch indeed. Spoken like a well-trained dog. <laughs> Careful, one day the master might find himself on the leash. <laughs> or the dog might find himself enthralled to his master as a corporate slave till the day he dies. Dang. How cute, they're studying. Hey, scrubs, playtime's over. The big kids need their spot. Hey, do you mind? We're trying to fill our heads with knowledge. 
<laughs> Put things up the world. We're not going anywhere. We reserve these seats in advance. Uh, yeah, you don't know what it is to study in air conditioning until you don't have it. Move along, please. Well, what do we have here, fellas? Oh my the God. hard luck cases to find. Sure, have some gall talking to me like that, you little twerp. And nice glasses, by the way. They make you look like a total nerd. Ha! Am I right? Says so you and him. Don't be so quick to judge. Huh? Look at her. Oh my, pearls before swine indeed. Hey there. Something tells me you're the sort of woman who gets her thrills from a sonnet. Okay. Make me wonder if my standards aren't too high. Don't be weird. Could you get out of my ear, please? She attracts the worst kind. I know. Holy shit. This poor girl. I know who these kids are. Come on, don't be a wuss. Where the hell's that attitude all of a sudden? If you wanted to, we'd even put our lives on the line. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Hey. Oh, I believe there's quite a lot we can do with that. If the demand is this. I can't read that. A contract that pledges their total subjugation to us in 50 separate clauses. You mean by that? I'm a little hurt. I'm just a student. Humbly exercising mm. his autonomy in a nurturing environment. I feel like I recognize this voice actor. What else has he done? My grasp of civil law is such that I know how to... I don't know why. It sounds familiar, though. Do we go along with the bastard anyway? Absolutely. He's the undisputed heavyweight champion of coercion. Gakushu Asano. I don't think there's anyone in this school who can beat him. Blast it all, Kuma! <laughs> wake up and get with the program! Apply yourself for heaven's sake! You can get the best overall score! Come. No, they become conundrums, riddles, outright beasts! Satisfactory. No doubt they will inspire. Nested among reams of legal jargon hides an item of special interest. A subclause. When A class takes the E class A question, they will answer truthfully concealing nothing. Whatever you're trying there to it is. Screen, father, don't think I won't find it. Finals day. Alright, Nagisa. For a few morons appreciate what you've gotten yourselves into. <laughs> oh my god! Or not. Who's that? Ritsu's proxy. Huh? Yeah, I know. The principal said an AI taking the finals was a uh, Hey, at least the man was okay with us using a stand in. That's true. You never have to deal with him giving you that look. You know the one, right? Yeah. So, like the battle began, I won't lose. I don't lose. Let's find out. Here we go. Things are about to get interesting. What's cool is while we're taking the exam separately, we're all in this together. There are the people we fight alongside of, the people we fight, mm. the ones who want us to lose, the ones who want us to win. Almost feels like an arena. Oh. We might be assassins, but right now, we have to fight like gladiators. Yep. Another day, another bell. Uh, round one. That might rank into Assassination Classroom Season 1, Episode 15, End of Term Time. So, the end of term is here, and apparently, um, Principal's son is around and here and is very diabolical because he wants to know what's up with E Class and what he, his dad is hiding. And he kind of made a contract that E class will answer any question truthfully. And that, would, so they would reveal what's happening. And then the exam just began at the end. Of course, we're not going to wait to find out what happened until next week. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I don't know. The stakes are high. So I still feel like Karma's going to do great. Karma's going to ace it. I think. I hope. So yeah, that's it.